Understanding the phrase, pretenses dropped, a guide to real conversations. Hello, everyone, welcome to our channel where we make English language learning fun and easy. Today, we're going to explore a fascinating phrase, pretenses dropped. It's a phrase that packs a lot of meaning and is quite useful in understanding real, authentic conversations. So, let's dive in and unravel its meaning together. In this section, we'll look at the individual words in pretenses dropped. Pretenses are a form of pretending or putting on an act. It's about showing something that isn't completely true or sincere. The word dropped here means to let go or abandon something. So, when put together, pretenses dropped suggests a situation where someone stops pretending and starts being more genuine and honest. Pretenses dropped is often used in scenarios where people are initially not being completely themselves. This could be due to social pressure, nervousness, or trying to impress others. However, when the pretenses are dropped, it signifies a shift to a more relaxed and authentic interaction. It's like removing a mask to reveal one's true self. Let's look at some examples to understand how this phrase is used. 1. In friendships. After a few weeks of polite conversation, their pretenses dropped, and they started to joke and laugh more freely. 2. In professional settings, the meeting started formally, but once the pretenses dropped, everyone shared their real opinions about the project. 3. In relationships, they were both trying to impress each other on the first date, but once the pretenses dropped, they connected more deeply. It's interesting to note that in different cultures, the time it takes for pretenses to drop can vary. In some cultures, people are more open and direct, leading to quicker authentic interactions. In others, it might take longer due to norms of politeness and formality. And that's all about pretenses dropped. We hope this video has helped you understand this phrase better and how it's used in real life conversations. Remember, language is not just about words. It's about the context, emotions, and connections they create. Keep learning and exploring, and we'll see you in our next video. Happy learning!